All right, so we're doing a short stream today. Um, so far, we've just just met up with Alize. So let's see how things go from here. But I do want to take this guy out. Here's what we'll do. I'll take the east side of the inn, you clear the west. That way you can get undiluted experience of what the resident terrors. Oh fun. These marks on your map are where they usually where the usual trouble spots are. You can assume that any beast with a white hide or a carapace is a sin eater, but you'll know for sure soon enough when they come slavering after your aether. Remember, it's kill or be killed with these monsters. Once you've slain whatever prowling, whatever's prowling out there, we can run everybody back to the north entrance and get out too. But Find a sin eater. Not to take out anything for a while. Okay. Wait a little bit. Yeah, to be honest, I'm a little tired of the desert scenery. 
Wait. I'm gonna be over here. Oh, I might not be able to get to it at the time, at current. Howdy, Farrah. I got two. out of the ordinary for this area. I expect you noticed it yourself, but individually, these lesser seed eaters are no more deadly than your natural predator you might encounter in the desert. It's when they appear in numbers that they pose a threat, much like the void scent. Void scent? They have a fortune tends to flock to the strongest of their kind. Thus, a powerful sin eater goes on the hunt. When a powerful sin eater goes on a hunt, it might be attended by a veritable swarm of weaker kin. Imagine an army of such creatures descending on a villager hamlet. That's that's the basic idea behind my patrols: to call their ranks often enough that their number won't be overwhelming when big ones come out to play. And you've certainly helped on that front. Let us report our victories to Tulsa. Tesla. Shall we? Yeah, this just feels like a whole new... Like, roughly a whole new game. Because of what's going on. Alice, tells me you helped, her, helped out on her patrol. You have our thanks, and my apologies for leading you from one battle to another ever since the moment we met. In any case, in any case, I'm glad to see the two of you found each other. You have no idea how badly Alice had missed your company. <laughs> Everything was always, if Sapphire were here, he would. That's an exaggeration. And I don't sound like that either. I was simply trying to view matters from another perspective, and I respect Sapphire's methods. Honestly, after seeing him in action, I can understand why. The way he leaps into the fray without hesitation is is really something to behold. I might be a little smitten myself. I'm only teasing. Well, I have no doubt he deserves all the admiration he gets, just as you do. I love to lay out a welcome a welcome meal, but the duties I put off when I went to market are still waiting for me. Uh, there are a hundred and one things that need doing. I'm sorry, but would you mind waiting here with Alice? Eh? What, twiddle, my, twiddle our thumbs while you work yourself to death? Surely there's something we can help you with. As per usual. I could do with a hand, it's true. Thank you. You can start by helping me sort out the larder, Alice. While we do that, you can tend to a few patients, perhaps. There were three in particular I mean to visit. It's just a matter of saying a few words to them and seeing that their skin isn't caked in sand. Their names are... Paul... Paulanil... And Totten... They may not give much in the way of response, but I promise they'll be pleased to meet someone new. It's always threes. Always threes. Never fails. Uh, where were they? I'm 
assuming they're in the area? Okay, yeah. Oh, they're all right here. Becoming like okay, hold on. I don't think we'll get a look at this one, will we? Oh, he's just he's miserable. spoke to me. <laughs> good. That's good. I knew they would enjoy meeting you. Sure? I'm concerned about Howard, though. I'll have to speak with the other carers, but I think his time may be near. Uh? We shall leave you to, dis to have that discussion, then. I'm going to take Sapphire to Mod Souk. If you have any errands that need doing. Well, I suppose there is one thing. Will you pick up a Nectarine from the markets, please? Kassard's caravan just passed through, so Ron Ron should have some fresh fruit. Come then. There's something I want you to see. Right after we stop at Ron Ron style, of course. Um, <sighs> my brain did a thing. This is a weird world, I'm not gonna lie. Back again, are you? Yeah. Actually, we need to buy a nectarine. Do you have any in stock? Yes, nectarines, peaches, grapes, fresh and juicy. And given how richly you cracked your coin purse with me, I might still owe you food. Here, take this one free of charge. Gods, I've seen a Mord merchant give away something for nothing before. How much did you spend here? Oh yes, I'll take a jar of honey-eyed worms as well. Oh no, they're not for me. It's an offering of sorts. To who? To what? Um, the worms, if you please. Only the best wrigglers for you. Come again, my friends. Right. 
that's our shopping chores taken care of. Let's head past the Aether to the main to the main tower. The view I can show you can only be seen from the very top. Precious rooms that buys us a trip to the top of the tower, does it not? Please, Wigglers, you actually brought them. I really shouldn't let you, but just this once, alright? Only once. Uh huh, sure. Never fails. Shall we? <laughs> Bribery. beyond. That's what the land became after the light flooded in. An empty white nothingness. Life cannot exist in such conditions. The primordial light would wreak havoc on the body's etheric balance. Nectarin you bought. It's Halric's favorite fruit. Most of the patients, Halric included, survived the attacks of powerful eaters. But their fate was sealed all the same. The monster's corruption has entered their bodies, and their very essence is being subsumed by light. The twisted state of the world itself just makes matters worse. Under normal circumstances, a person's ether naturally tends to equilibrium. But for these poor souls, the opposite is true. Sooner or later, every single one of them will turn. Teslin and the patients, they all know this. They know what has to be done before the change goes too far, before the eater within takes over. The preferred method is mixing poison into their favorite food. In my time here, I've borne witness to a lot of last meals. That's... I feel just as helpless as before. No matter how hard I fight, it's never enough. But it's a war I mean to wage, nonetheless. Speaking of wars, do you remember how I made you promise not to leave me and then promptly collapsed? <laughs> yes! Well, let's just say I had a few choice words for the Exarch concerning the timing of his summons. Wow. Oh yeah, that's right. She was not happy. But even if the fault lay with someone else, I couldn't shake the feeling that I'd abandon you on the battlefield. So I swore that I'd make up for my absence there by making a difference here. And that's what keeps me moving forward, even when things seem hopeless. On which note, it's time we headed back. The longer we keep Tessling waiting, the harder this will be for her. Why do I get the feeling this is like her sibling? Okay, I'm glad I went with this hairstyle. This it's it's a progression of my character's hair, which I think by Endwalker I will probably shorten. I'm glad I was able to show you that. When it comes to understanding the catastrophe which befell the first, one glimpse of an empty wasteland beyond the wall 
is worth more than an hour of Rioch's luxury. Damn, okay. You needed to know beyond a doubt that Tuslin has no other choice. The Nectarine will be with Kindness. It isn't just a threat threat pros to others. When a person becomes an eater, the pain appears to be excruciating. The carers are truly fond of their wards and would spin and would spare them that suffering. It is their way of fighting back against a fate worse than death. Jeez. Like, I understand, yeah, this is dark, but this is just like heavy dark. I mean, because previously it's just been like, all right, you have the have and the have nots, and a war, and then another war. I just realized Heavensward was a war, Stormblood was a full on war and retaliation of war, and then this is straight up, we are fighting to survive. This is straight up, we are fighting to survive against a catastrophe. You're back. I hope you had a nice time. Did you manage to find a nectarine? Here you go. Thank you. LSA explained why I wanted this. Has she? I can see it in your eyes. But we may not need it just yet. I spoke with the others and, they, and we've decided to keep an eye on Halric for now. Thanks to you, though... If his time does come suddenly, we'll be ready to send him on his way with a taste of happier days. That is so sad. Oh my god, that is so sad. Well, nothing's going to happen for a little while yet, so let's see if we can't light the mood. We don't want our gloomy faces worrying the patients. I think it's time that for that welcome hole, don't you? Take a seat, and I'll make us a nice stew. Oh, this stream might not even be an hour. Speak up if you'd like another helping. I made a little bit more than usual today. And you've added something special to the broth, if I'm not mistaken. I well, it's not often we have visitors from the Crystarium, so I may have thrown in a few extra bits and bobs. You even have gone through all that trouble. Oh, it's nothing, really. We do so rarely have guests. In a place like this, you learn to take what moments of happiness you can get. Jeez. I remember when I first came here with my mother. She was showing the early signs. So my question is, how do you get poisoned? Is it because you get attacked? I knew there was no way to save her, but I just couldn't face what needed to be done. That's the way of it for most people. Why they travel for moms to stay here. Beaten, broken souls come to wait out the inevitable, to receive the mercy of a painless death. That grinds on the soul. When my mother finally left this world, I was mad with grief. But also thankful that her passing was a peaceful one. Jeez. It's never easy, ending a life you've cared for even when you believe they go on to a better place. I often find myself wishing the warrior of darkness would come and do that part for me. 
the warrior of darkness. You've never heard the tale. Oh, that's right, because Alice was sure with us. Again, but every child in Norrent could tell you a version of it. Alice was not with us during that. I totally forgot. Warrior of darkness, servant of death, take care of our souls at our dying breath. Let sinners and eaters of sin go with thee, that all may return to the sunless sea. Well, that's the version I was taught anyway. It's just an old bedtime story. He certainly never deigned to visit us here. Which is a good thing, surely. He sounds rather ominous. Do you think so? I always liked the idea that he treated every soul the same, even the Sin Eaters. Okay, see, now I'm curious. Is the Way of Darkness Arden, or is it us? Did it become one? So I assume when a human becomes a sin eater, when they officially become one, they all of a sudden you randomly because you create a Sin Eater, all of a sudden several more show up. Ugh, that's... I wonder. That's a little creepy if, if that's the case. Sapphire LSA, we have to go look for Halric. I don't know what's gotten into him if he's wandered out there alone. We'll assign each... We'll assign search areas and split up. Any idea where he might be headed? No, he's never done anything like this before. But I can't but it can't be coincidence that the other patients are suddenly so agitated they can sense something. In any case, let's keep the search close to the end. Halric isn't very sure on his feet, so he wouldn't have gone far. Let's, I'll search the east side. Please, Halric, please be alright. To the south we go. fighting.
also reminds me, where is that ancient room? Any sign of him? Life this music is never good. No luck then. But he surely can't have gone far. Oh, this music's not good. We should keep looking. The Sin Eaters are out in force, and if we don't find him soon, you can be sure they will. What we fought in the well, this is the size of that thing. It must be one of the nasty ones. Wherever it's going, it can only mean trouble. After it. So this is what we. This is what Warrior of Light finds. Hey. Not too bad. I'm, uh, I'm actually just doing a short stream today. Oh no! How are you? So you're gonna become on West Coast, SoCal. We all deserve happiness, wherever we can find it. How about you? The time left to you is precious. No one should die in vain. Mother, mother, I.
This is... I stream off and on, I'm not constant. Okay. Well, welcome to the stream. I'm sorry, I tried to tell him that cares what happened, but I can't be the shoulder they lean on, not like this. So that means it's up to me. Yeah, I... Stream-wise, I used to usually play Star Wars The Old Republic, Planet Coaster, and, um... Uh, and now, obviously, Final Fantasy XIV. It's just so unfair. Tussling was always so cheery with the patients, telling them not to be scared. That there wouldn't be any pain. Of all the people in the world to suffer such a fate. Yeah, that's I now understand where they're like, oh it's a fate it's a fate worse worse than death. Uh, it's a fate worse than death. I've been I originally so a little bit of history about me. I started streaming during the pandemic, um, with Star Wars The Old Republic and Planet Coaster, and then eventually one of my friends got me into Final Fantasy XIV, and then I've been here ever since. So I've been playing, I've probably been playing XIV for about, eh, give or take, three years now? I imagine you're just as shocked as the rest of us, so I appreciate what you're doing here. Me? I can barely, I don't have the words. Without a body, um, as of current Final Fantasy fourteen, um, yeah, as of current Final Fantasy fourteen, um, I usually will probably stream Star Wars: The Old Republic every blue moon. I don't have the words. Without a body, we can't give even her a proper word. Ah. Uh, and she cared about that sort of thing, about giving people a chance to say they're Dude! Okay. I'm starting to understand why people are like, Shadowbringers is the expansion. By any chance you play uh, 14? Oh my god, of course right when I click on him he decides to move. No, it's not my usual type of game. Thank you, what you're doing, it, it means a lot to them, to me.
I'm more of an RPG type. Um, RPG, usually a lot of fantasy. Sorry to interrupt. Um, we realized we hadn't thanked you for rescuing Halric. You weren't hurt at all, were you? Hurt? There wasn't even a fight. It was too late, too slow. And I thought I could protect you. Well, that's good to hear. You can't blame yourself for things beyond your control. You brought Halric back safe and sound. No one could have done any more. Oh, she's gonna be beat herself up about this. I'm sorry, but I've made I've come to a decision. I won't be continuing in my role here. I hope you will forgive me for leaving you, and that you will delay Halric's last meal for as long as you possibly can. Not until it's too late, of course. Just give him what time you can. You always do. Of course, she would have done the same. Farewell, Halric. Keep Tuslin's words close to your heart. Oh, okay. very moment. I understand how you must feel, but surely it's been... Oh, I missed that last part. I have a destination in mind. Uh, this damn light, without it, without cease, is the reason we can't save those corrupted by the Sin Eaters. I think my dude was more ex exclamation for, uh, for the game, sorry. But what if we corrected the balance? Even if it took years, it would surely make things better. Now hold on there. Everyone knows there's too much light. How could you ever hope to get rid of it? You'd have to change the whole world. Uh, and thus begins our grand quest. Return to Crystarium. I may not be able to repel the sin eaters on my own, but I still can have skills. Oh, uh, stream's going pretty well. I think actually after this, um, after this cutscene, or whenever we get ready to start our search for Alpha now, is where we're gonna end. Because uh, I really didn't. Uh, actually, I didn't plan on streaming today. I was planning on... Where'd she go? Or did she literally go to the Crystarium? Okay, she went to the Crystarium. Yep. Um, I originally wasn't planning on streaming today, and I was like, eh, I've got time before work. Why not? So, yeah. She's here. Ah, she is. Oh, okay, I know where she is. So yeah, it was, um... I was like, I've got some time before work, so I might as well just get some of this stream in. And I've been wanting to at least get to finish out my Alice A side mission. Um, I work in a theme park industry. Usually I'm like, I'll go to the gym. I should go to the gym. And then just watch a bunch of Disney Plus. And try and catch up on anime when I can. That's the hard part. You will visit Alphano in Colusia? Okay, excellent. As I mentioned, your destination is an island off the west coast, so you will need a capable mount to make the journey. Letter of introduction present to 
the Master of the Beast at the Rookery. He will take care of you. Yeah, usually, um, I just go to the gym to do, like, a cardio class or, uh, swim, because I just love swimming. Oops. I just realized how I messed up. Okay. I was not supposed to go to the Quisterium just yet. play this fun game of can I get through? I'll go for it. I'm good. I actually have a few friends who are in the same field as you. Yeah, there's no way around this. I'm gonna have to fight these guys off. I do hope things are going well in your condition. good. Um, because I, ha I do have my friends I can do that with. It's just I don't stream enough for me to actually warrant it. Honestly. Like if I was if I was like a hardcore streamer, I'd be all for it. Like yeah, let's do it. But I'm so I'm just so casual with it. Like this is the aside from New Year's Day, I hadn't streamed in like two three months, mainly because of work. But thank you for the offer. Um, and I, do you mind if I pass on your stream info to several, f several friends that are streamers of mine?
Yeah, I but yeah, I will totally pass. I will totally pass on info. If they hit you up, they hit you up. If they don't, they just don't. I don't know. Cuz I know a few of my streamer friends do have uh have their own setups they do. But thank you for the offer. Forgive me, Sapphire. I couldn't stay here a moment longer. I was serious about what I said. While the men and women in the end battle against this blight with kindness, I must fight it in my own way with steel. Miss Halsey, is there anything I can get you? The swift, your swiftest. I'm gonna call it a bird because because that's what I know it to be. That's right, because we did travel to the... Uh, I don't know why I didn't think about that. Remind me to wear goggles if we ever fly over Amar again. I've barely got the sand out of my eyes. But the wind did help clear my head at least. I think I'm ready to meet the Exarch. We need to talk about how we're going to wipe the Sin Eaters out, shall we? Thank you for seeking me out, Sapphire. It meant a lot to have you there at my side. I was tempted to set off again the moment we had decided upon a direction, but you still have to visit Alfino, haven't you? If I know my brother, he'll be on the cusp of discovering something vital to our success, if he hasn't already. I'm content to stay here and consider our options for the time being. But don't keep me waiting too long, eh? All right. So I kind of did these last two missions flipped. Um, that wasn't what I was trying to do, but at least it worked out. Um, all right. So with that, um, I actually don't know when I'm going to stream next, just because work schedule. Um, we're coming out of the holidays at work, and so I'm we're getting we're gearing up from for some stuff, and then I have a bunch of stuff that I'm doing in my life as well. Um, so feel free to visit my YouTube. Um, the videos will be posted at some point. Um, as it's looking right now, this, my streams are going to be ahead of my YouTube videos. And that's kind of how I want it to be. Um, but yeah, so hit that follow button. Hit that follow button. That way you can be aware of when I go live. Um, I don't want to actually give a date on when I'm going to go live next, just because. Um, but as usual, be good to yourself, be good to others, and stay true to you. Peace. And if you're looking for the YouTube, it's just look up youtube.com slash sapphire31. Laters.